scale last time we had looked at this figure in dollars and we saw that you could very well write down this figure rewrite it without these zeros because they were not significant in fact we saw that the first significant figure in any number is the first non zero digit that you see looking from left to right so this is a zero digit not a significant figure we haven't reached the first significant figure yet this one this one this one these are all zero digits this is the first non zero digit that we see when we look from left to right and the number of digits we have is here is one two three four five six all right what we want to do is write down a number to a specified number of significant figures so let's change this to number of significant figures all right now this figure is a certain amount of money when you write to a number of significant figure you might have to round off and in this case you don't want to go rounding off people's money they will sue you right and probably you will end up going to jail or people won't seek your services again as a banker or financial advisor all right so you don't want to be playing around with rounding off money so let's leave that out for now and look at another number that justifies rounding off all right now um in jamaica and the figure for the population is usually given as say an example that i hear sometimes some a few years ago i heard it was 2.7 million that's the population to two significant figures but how does that work let's see every 10 years there's a census government conduct a census that means they do a study of at least they try to do a study of the entire population and that includes counting the number of people who are residing in Jamaica right who are residents now the population after a certain census it might might have been a case where they counted the number as two million six hundred and seventy five thousand nine hundred and twenty say twenty three mm -hmm. at the end of the day that is the number of people that they count now would it make sense going around giving presentations to audiences and say putting up that figure on a screen and saying that we have a population of two million six hundred and seventy five thousand nine hundred and twenty three no it would make sense all right it would look really ridiculous because first of all there were people who were not counted with all the money that government spends and all the workers that they send out and their 
efforts to try to reach everybody a lot of people were n just not counted they live in far remote areas and were not counted some and suppose um it so happened that everybody was counted guess what someone dies in, i mean within the first hour after they count some people die you have babies born and that figure change so even if that was the case and the thing is as time goes by the figure drastically changes and it keeps going up well based on past trends although you might have nowadays the population growth um, slowing down but let's assume that it keeps going up all right it just makes sense to use or to round this off to a number of significant figure now if you get this figure of two million six hundred and seventy five thousand hundred and twenty three and you're told to write this to two significant figures Or let me not say two significant figures yet let's say this is one two three four five six seven this is a number to seven significant figures this is to seven significant figures all right i just use sig fig for significant figures instead of the effort and stress to write out the entire words right now now suppose you need to write this down to say six significant figures six significant figures what would you write let's see you have two that's the first one and the six in the, uh, where did I put a comma second significant figure third fourth fifth significant figure and six and the two is a six significant figure let's see what happening here if you write that down then what you would be saying is that the number of people in Jamaica is 267,552 something is drastically wrong with that you have to fix that all right something's definitely wrong you can't have 2.2 million something 2 million and odd people and you go down to 200 and something no sir no no something is wrong what are you going to do you must change the three to zero the zero is important because it shows the size of the number you cannot leave it out so that is to six significant figures this to one two three four five six significant figures you have to put this zero here it contributes to showing the size of the number all right now let us do something else we want to write this figure to five significant figures to five significant figures what is this this is the first second third fourth and the fifth significant figure you cannot stop there because you would be saying that the population is 26,755 you can't do that if you started with a figure of 2 million and something when you round it off to a certain number of significant figure it should remain 2 million and something so it should be 2 million 
right two million and put in the zeros here to show to fill in the spots here to show that it is two million and something it's over two million all right now what about writing it to four significant figures you want to write this number to four significant figure the first second third fourth all right good now we have something to look at here it is not two thousand and odd people it is two million and odd so it's two million you put the comma here because you know it's two million six twenty seven thousand all right what are you going to put here we have a few things to deal with here you're stopping at this five but guess what before you rounded it off and wrote it to four significant figure you realize that the next digit to the right of this five is five and according to the rule what must you do you must go back to this five where you stop and add one to it so it will be the figure here will be six then you fill this the spaces in to show that it's two million so you say it's two million six hundred and seventy six thousand all right now what about writing it to three significant figures to three significant figures now means you have the first the second and the third but looking up here you're stopping at the seven but the number to the right of seven was five don't use this to come here use this one don't use it to don't go from the four significant figure to the three significant figure look at this up here the full number the number to the right of it was five so you're going to have to add one to this seven so we have to backtrack here and instead of seven put eight and you have to show that it is two million and something so it's two million then we have six eight we have to fill in the spaces with the zeros to show that it is two million and something people it's not 268 people live in jamaica it is two million six hundred and eighty thousand but then in general as i said before the figure is written to two significant figures so the first significant figure is two here the second is six but you realize that the number the figure to the right of six is seven so you're going to have to write add to one to the six and put seven it's two million and something so it's two million then you see the seven you must fill in the hundred thousand to two significant figure it is two million seven hundred and um two million seven hundred thousand in other words 2.7 million all right 2.7 times a million will give you this so this is the same figure as this so that's the two significant figures you must put the zeros in in order to show the size of the number if you started out with two million and something thousand and odd when you write this figure to a certain number of significant figures you round off and it should be the same two million and something if it's to one significant figure i want you to tell me what it would be so i won't do that i'm going to ask you in the comment you can do that 
to write this this number to one significant figure all right um that will be it for this video i will see you later